Anchor are world leaders in CNC cutter grinding technology. Speaking of world leaders, we're here at Renishaw in South Wales where we're going to be learning much, much more about this relationship. Darren, I know you've been working with Anchor for over six years now. Yep. How, how have you found the experience? Uh, the Anchor machine is a very reliable machine. It's very easy to use, a uh, very productive machine. Um, it's very simple to program, very flexible to program. The operators like it, maintenance like it. Uh, and so, so far, we've, uh, yeah, it's been a very good experience with Anchor. And what products are you manufacturing? Uh, we manufacture purely for ourselves. Uh, manufacturing uh, end mills, slot drills, spot drills, a uh, few drills, um, product, predominantly sort of tailored for ourselves, our own use. And this isn't your first one, is it? No, this is our second uh, anchor uh, here at Miskin. Um, the, the other ones at our factory in Stonehouse, which is where I'm based. Um, we've had that for about five years, five and a half years. Um, and then last year we purchased this one to, in, to increase our capacity. You say the operators like the machine. What is it that they like? The, the controller is very easy to use, it's very simple to use, um, it's very menu-led, so it's, it's not a difficult controller at all, so it's, it's nice, it's not, lots of graphics and things like that, so it's, it's simple to use. And prior to purchasing the Anchor, did you go to market, did you look at some of the other options? Yes, we, we looked at um, uh, the, the, big, the big names, you, you, sort of the, the other manufacturers that are, are out there, but we find that the Anchor best suited our, our needs really. And what features on this machine do you have? Is it automated, for example? Yes, it's automated. We have a robot loader, uh, we have the in-cycle probing, uh, and we have a wheel measuring probing. So with the, with, the, with the robot loader, it enables us to grind up to eight, nine, ten hours lights out. So very useful. And why do you actually manufacture your cutting tools? It seems an obvious question. Is it purely for price or delivery of tools? Um, it's twofold. Cost of tools is, is, a big, is a big thing. We save probably 40 to 50% on our price of our tooling. Um, the other thing is that we can tailor the tools to our application. Um, I, I, we design tools so that they work best for us in our manufacturing facility. Um, for lights out, uh, manufacturing, they, they can run 24 hours and they need to be able to trust the tooling. And we, we develop tooling to suit that, really. And you've got two currently. If there's a third CNC grinder, is it likely to be an anchor? Most likely it would be an anchor. It, it makes sense. I'm, I'm based at Stonehouse, so I'm 60 miles away. So the fact that we have the two grinders that are the same, I can support that remotely um, with the aid of a laptop and the phone. So it, it, it doesn't pay for us to go anywhere else, really, you know what I mean? So at this point, there's no, no need to change. So in terms of programming, is it done offline? Uh, yes, we tend to program offline. Um, I've got a PC at my desk and I program everything on there. Um, if I need to come down to Miskin and support it remotely, I've got it all on a laptop. Um, I do all the prove outs on the system. I can fine tune the programs so I reduce cycle time. I can make sure that it's not going to collide with anything on the machine prior to going mm -hmm. into, produ into production. Um, and then on the grinders, it's just proven out. And, uh, so it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's a very good way of doing things. And I know this is a, a newer machine compared to the one at Stonehouse. So how do the controls differ? The software, so the controls, they look very, uh, very slightly different, um, but the actual software is identical. So that was very important to us that because we had two uh, machines that were on the same factory, that it was very important that the machines were practically identical in the way they, they're programmed and the way they're used. Martin, Renishaw, it's a real British success story, but maybe for the few engineers that don't know of Renishaw, you can tell them a little more. Yeah, sure. So uh, Renishaw, we are a UK-based um, world leader in uh, engineering technologies. We supply manufacturers around the world with measurement um, systems and sensing equipment, which allows these companies to automate a lot of their processes to allow them to produce high quality piece parts in potentially high volumes. Give me an example of what components you're talking about. So we, we manufacture a vast degree of components. We, we manufacture for CMM, so coordinate measuring machines. We manufacture parts for that. Also machine tool probing, so any probing that needs to be happened gets done, taken place on the machine. We manufacture that here. Okay, and you're also stepping away from what you class as normal engineering, getting involved in neuroscience and things like this as well. Indeed, we're uh, diversing into, the, into brain surgery and also looking into uh, dentistry. And here at Renishaw, you're not shy of investing money, are you? Just look at this facility. Of course, yeah. Just Miskin alone, uh, the investment is, is into the tens of millions and we're working closely within that investment with companies such as Mazak and Anchor. 